straight days of patrolling. I'm exhausted. Supply line in the city. Am I? Me. Listen, the infected won't listen to your Yesterday in the canteen, they accidentally gave Pug. a double portion of dinner. And it turned out that the Butch is our greatest enemy. He's responsible for the Black Monday bombing to the death of two million people. Oh, man, that sucks. Stuff like that. <laughs> See something suspicious, report it to the PKs, yeah? <coughs> Keep your nose clean, and we won't have any problems. <coughs>
State your business, citizen. We're on duty here. I hope Jack Matt deals with these damn renegades. Don't want my name ending up in some memorial down in the streets. Pilgrim, we spotted specials in the neighborhood. Keep your eyes peeled. Some strange dude he's loitering around my place. I talk to him politely and he starts waving at me. Seen the one. Can't you see we're having a conversation? I'm just looking for a friend. The one. You sure you know what to do if you catch that tiger by the tail? Anyhow, she's probably out in the field somewhere. But you can ask at the bar. For the one, you know, I can find her. She was just here. Boo! Still didn't break your neck? Good. This him? The gajo you were talking about? That you are. I've heard a lot about you. So good or bad things? Not a hideous gajo. Medic have Kyla Van Lupino tut. Sarchawa Vesawa Dukhawa to Tiknok Fu Bakrano Merak Hava Tut Fchufava Tre Tutar Vutsnia. Daniel! Back off! Imbecile. Never chop Weska, you saw outside there. Wesa Subida. Jesus. Jealous much, Daniel? We were never together, got it? Give it a rest. What are you talking about? That Levant friends are my friends. Daniel says that to get the power flowing, we have to reactivate the other substations. On, but the cables couldn't take it. Fifteen years took a toll. Atrophy musculare means to eat it. Untrained muscles wither. Come on, Frank's room is over there. Let's figure out why Waltz turned it on in the first place. Good talk, Gajo. Better watch your back. Go away, huh? The PKs promise a lot, but when it comes to power, they don't seem to share. Are we going? One thing about Frank. Do you see these people? Anywhere else, they'd be savages at each other's throats, but not here. Here, they stay calm, cool, and collected because of Frank. They respect him because he was a night runner. Everyone here owes him something, including me. If it wasn't for Frank, I wouldn't be here. And where would you be? In a dark zone as a biter, or in some den, high and about to get higher. Frank will help us. You can rely on him too. Try.
trust me. Ready? Let's go. Frank! They slaughtered us. One by one, like fucking rabbits. Frank? Frank, it's me. Wake up! You? What the fuck you doing here? Interrupting my conversation with... Robert's been dead for years, Frank. Pull yourself together. You got a visitor. Uh, who's that? Queen of fucking England? I gotta act all dainty now. This is Aiden. He has the GRE access key. Waltz used it to turn on the electricity in town. Working GRE key? You're full of shit. Show it to him. Where'd you get it? Uh, from one of Waltz's men. So you want a Waltz's men too? Hey, easy, Frank. Aiden is on our side. We think this contains data proving what they did to us in the hospital. Uh, so you still believe you'll find out why Waltz fucked up your childhood? Okay, I'll tell you. Ready? Uh, uh, yeah, because he's a fucking psycho. He's fucked in the head. That's your holy grail and Ark of the Covenant all in one, Lord. Happy? Aiden, right? You and Luang can get the fuck out of my face now. I got more important things in my mind. <sighs> it would have worked if that fucker had showed up at the TV station. You were right, Ravik. Fucking traitor. Without him, we were like kids with slingshots going up against tanks. We're not finished here, Frank. This contains info on someone I'm looking for, too. I need to know how to read it. It's a fucking key, not a diary. You can use it to open doors, start the electricity, but it's useless on its own. You need some place to stick it. And before I tell you where you can stick it, get out! You'll give him your fucking headache! Ravik, you fucking bastard. Why did you come back for this mission? Everything went wrong, so many people. So many wonderful people. <sighs> Luan says only you can help us. Luan tends to run at the mouth. And you know what? It's mostly bullshit. She's a junkie I picked up from the street. Understand? You don't believe me, ask her. She'll tell you everything herself. So what the fuck if we got to that floor? We were in a pile of shit. Not even close. Maybe this tower is not being won and will not be won. You understand? We're all gonna fucking die and then it'll be cool. You'll shut up too. I didn't come this far to let you blow me off like this, Frank. You came all this way to talk to little old me? Well, laddy fucking daw. Congratulations. You're a bigger loser than I am. Now get the fuck out of here already. See this, Ravik? He can't piss me off almost as much as you. Shut up! That doesn't mean you can talk! Fuck, Ravik! Stop making excuses for this traitor! Denying what's happened! Frank, damn it! Come back! Fuck off, kid. And while you're a fucking off, take Luan with you. I'm done. Luan, it seems we're done here. Come on, let's go. <sighs> Waltz turned the power on with this key for the first time in years. And I doubt he did that out of the kindness of his heart. And you don't give a fuck? Frank, get your shit together. You were a legend. Fucking commander of the Night Runners. Do you even remember that? That Frank is dead, Luan. He died with the others at the TV station. Why the fuck would Waltz turn on the power? Don't ask me. I don't have a clue. But if you're looking for the GRE database, you need to find a terminal to access it. But the thing is, I... I have no idea where one could be. And those who knew are... probably long dead.
But the good news is we'll probably be dead ourselves soon enough. Cheers. Now, get the fuck out of my quarters. <laughs> Fucking drunkard. Thank <laughs> you. 
in the area. Yes, Commander. You. You all right, boy? Jack, man. Come on, Frank. You all right? I saw you fight. What's your name? Aiden. If it weren't for you, a lot more would be dead. Come on, boys. Search the area. Sir, I have a question. We're looking for a GRE database. Most GRE equipment has been dead for years. What do you need this database for? With your knowledge of the city, you know GRE places inside out. Aiden and I need to find this database. Will you help us? Luan, he's your friend. <laughs> Aiden? You could say that. I've never heard of you, Aiden. Where are you from? I'm a pilgrim. I came from outside the walls. So you've seen a lot? You probably came through old Villador too, right? All right, what do you want to know? A lot has been going on there lately. We lost our commander, and the Bazarians tried to cut off our power source. Fortunately, they failed, and we held our position. But the fighting continues. We're losing people. I also lost contact with the new commander, Ator and his unit. Know anything about them? We found Waltz, but he overpowered us and escaped. What? Where? In the tunnels, near the car plant. Waltz decimated Ader's squad. I barely managed to escape. I shouldn't have left them like this. We need to find out what's going on there. As for the GRE equipment you're asking about, you can ask Lieutenant Rowe. If something's working, he'll know about it. Lately, he and his unit have been securing the Culver Island and New Dawn Park areas. But because of the Butcher's raid, we had to go radio silent. So you have to look for him yourselves. If you find him, give him these. What are they? Orders for him and the other units. Move it, boys. Let's go. Come outside. Let's talk.
Stay frosty. That might still be dead. Where did you learn to fight like that? Where? On the road? As a pilgrim? I had no other choice. On the road? <laughs> Don't you wonder sometimes what they gave us to make us like this? Stronger? Rather fucked in the head. But yeah, fucked up and stronger. Maybe I'll figure that out when I find Mia. What's next? Well, you heard it yourself. Ro might know where you can access that damn database. Here, take these orders to him. Just don't lose them, or Jack will gut me. What about you? I'll join you. But first, I have to see Frank. You saw him. He's barely holding it together. Okay. Good. Start with Culvert Island. The PK have an outpost there. And stay on the radio all the time. Sure thing, partner. The PK's sure pissed off the renegades this time. This will bring trouble for sure. Culvert Island. Great. Frank sorted out, so I'm on my way. If you get Ro to tell you where the terminal is, <coughs> let me know. You'll find your sister. I'll find the missing names of assholes for my kill list. Everyone will be happy. Except the people you shoot. They won't be in any condition to care. Yeah. <laughs> 
from the commander. I ain't Roe. He went off with a squad to New Dawn Park. I'm Lieutenant Grady. Great. Guess I gotta keep going. What are you talking about? Show me those orders, son. I was supposed to give them directly to Roe. And I'm Roe when Roe's not here. It's called chain of command. Give him. What the hell? Did the commander say why we're being pulled back to center? He didn't seem too eager to explain anything to me. I'm just the messenger. Okay, boys, time to pack it in. Command's ordered us to withdraw. It's back to base for us. We're doing what? We're leaving this outpost? Don't question me. You can't hide behind Meyer's skirt out here. You're... you're abandoning us? What do we do? We'll be defenseless. Go arm the survivors. Then we roll. Hey, if I were you, I'd give them plenty of weapons. The renegades sent a whole detachment to the fisheye. Any other bright ideas, civilian? And just a question. Where can I find Ro? New Dawn Park, like I said. I'm not sure if they made it yet. You take these to him and tell him I'm on it. <laughs> Better you than me, buddy. Ro's gonna blow his top when he reads these. And I'm here to save lives, not lose mine. Yeah, thanks for the tip. Assholes. We won't stand a chance. I'm really sorry, civilian, but we have orders. You can't leave us. If the renegades come, we'll be dead within a day. Easy there, civilian. Well, our hearts. Old men and women. All the youngsters have already joined the PK. No much I can do, civilian. No <sighs> Fucking idiots. Pulling orders out of their ass, putting innocent people. Me. People will always complain. We're alive, and that's what counts. A risk.
Go on. I'm going to New Dawn Park. Apparently, Roe went there. I still don't understand why the renegades attacked the fish eye. They've got their camps, but Butcher hasn't attacked the fish eye since never. Even he respected the night runner, so no fucking clue what's going on in his head. The Butcher. Tell me more about him. The Colonel. He is the leader of the renegades. He gave the order to douse the city in chemicals. That's when my parents died. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not. Saw my dad once in my whole life. And if mom was good at anything, it was drinking. She abandoned me. That's how you ended up in Walt's program? <sighs> More or less. And your parents? Remember them? No. I just remember the hospital. The pain. And the fire. Right before they split me and Mia up. Let's focus on the job, okay? Okay, tough guy. Last one there's a rotten egg.
I'm looking for Lieutenant Rowe. You seen him? Who are you? Why do you want to know? I have orders from Major Matt. Lieutenant Grady said he was here. It'll be okay. Where's your squad and commander? We were making camp when Renegades attacked us. Rowe and the others, they got a few. 
and they went after the ones that tried to run. What about you? Couldn't keep up, and lost contact with them. Then another group attacked me. What are they doing here? The renegades weren't attacking our positions in the center. Oh, fuck. Hey! Get some rats here! Be careful. Hide. Go to hell. Sure! Already leaving. <laughs> Aren't we, gentlemen? Let's get them! safe now. You can come out. So, um, where's Rome? Uh, camp was supposed to be up there on the hotel roof, by the junction with Newell's Drive. There's a winch in the back of the building. You can take that up. If they haven't been able to come back yet, that's where you'll find them. Thanks. If you can make it back to base on your own, go there. And don't let yourself get chased into a box again. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> 
some renegades. Stairs. Yes, sir, Lieutenant, sir. Are the renegades outside? They won't bother you. You took them out? Who are you? Aiden. I got orders from Jack Matt. Well, fuck me. Let's look at what Santa's else of brought Withdrawal? Now? This is some kind of fucking joke. 
know how many men I lost to secure this miserable plot of land? Look, I don't, Lieutenant, but I have Five. other... Five of our very best. Bartez killed more virals than an entire unit. Sierra and Little Ron? They've been fighting at my side since before the fall. They gave their lives for that scrap of the city, and now what? I'm supposed to pull back? Listen, I'm just a messenger. Just calm down and talk. Oh, you don't think I'm calm, huh? I'm a fucking oasis of zen. Nirvana fucking walking. Bartez's husband. How's he gonna keep calm, huh? When I leave her body on this godforsaken turf. Sierra and Brasco's mom? She's not gonna be calm to learn her boys died here in vain. What should I tell him? All this for nothing just cause Matt signed a piece of paper and sent it to me? We do the real work out here, and it's nothing to Matt to take it all away with a smear of ink. Fucking total bullshit. I'm looking for access to the GRE database. I hear you know where I can do that. Yeah, I do. But why the fuck would I tell you under the circumstances? I got important, if idiotic, business to attend to. Get out of my sight. Okay, gentlemen. Gather the dog tags of the fallen. It fucking sucks. But an order's an order. Bro, wait. Luan, you come to piss me off too? You know me, Ro. Aiden and me both are looking for that GRE database. And you're gonna tell us. You wanna drag this out? Or take care of it here and now? <laughs> Fuck. Why are you after the database? I've heard it was stored on servers in the Observatory Command Center. But that building was destroyed in the chemical attacks years ago. The bombings came one after the other, like we were the fucking Viet Cong. Nothing was left. Understand? Nada. If you want, check for yourselves. Gentlemen, we're going. What's next? Next? <laughs> Didn't you hear? That database sounds long gone. So much for discovering the mystery of our childhood. I'll go back to looking for the shits on my hit list. And you? You can enjoy life in the center. I'm going to the observatory. Then you're going alone. So, we're splitting up? All good things must come to an end. The butcher and the pricks from my list? They'll find this out soon enough. I'm going back to looking for them. You shouldn't stay here either. <sighs> Aiden? I'm sorry you didn't find your sister. Yeah, thanks. You've always got Waltz. He probably knows what happened to her. If I find him, I'll let you know. Good luck, Gajo. Take care, Luan. I'm really not going with you.
Shoot first, ask questions later. Goddamn minute. Don't think I've seen you. That ain't quite right.
Major Matt, Aiden here. Aiden, good to hear you, son. You said maybe you could help me out. I'd like to ask how. Not over the radio. Come to the ship, to the main HQ. I'll be there soon myself. All right.
did they serve yesterday? Identify. Halt. Biomark. Here. Report to Meyer in dispatch. The commander is on his way back from the field. Thanks. Dispatch. There. All right, men. We take care of the UV lamps and head back to base. It should be on point, fast, and easy. Go, go, go. I remember you from the canteen. Yeah, I, I guess. From the fight in the canteen? Uh, maybe. Don't sweat it. You can really hold your own. I respect that. Aiden, right? Commander told me to brief you about faction matters. Missy welcomes you. Where is Matt? In the field. He came across a lead in Old Villador. You gotta wait. See that board? I got plenty that needs doing and not enough men. You wanna pick up some of our slack? We pay well. Medic, hurry! Fuck, that's Major Matt. Medic, Something's hurry. happened. Make room! Clear the way! He's bleeding out! Fuck! Oh Aider's in really bad shape. Save him. Take him to the infirmary! Don't Summon the medics! Going. We have to save him. Hang on, Ator. We won't let you go. You hear me? Get moving. Better hope Ader survives. We lost too many people in old Villador. Jack will do all he can to find out who did this. Juan would rather enjoy his caviar than take care of that lamp. I heard about 
you, why don't you join the PKs? I hope Peter survives. He's one of our most dedicated men. <coughs> Aiden, don't just stand there. Come. Know what this is? These brass knuckles belonged first to Commander Lucas. Then, they passed on to Ator. What happened in Old Villador? It can't happen again. We have to save the city, Aiden. From the plague, from the butcher and his men. Whatever they're planning. Okay. But over the radio, you said you have information for me. Yes, but before we get down to that, tell me, Aiden, what do you need this database for? What does it contain? I'm looking for my sister. What happened to her? A long time ago, Waltz hurt her. He took her from me. And I want him to tell me where she is. If she's still alive somewhere, or... That's why I was looking for the GRE command center. To access Waltz's database on its servers. So we have a common enemy. Meaning? Waltz. That's the Butcher's right-hand man. He pumps his men full of inhibitors. We can get them both. I brought you here because I know that a few GRE scientists are hiding out in the city. We picked up the trail of one of them right before the renegade attack. Sounds promising. When I find a scientist, we'll see what they know. If they are of no use, we'll find another and another until you get the answers you're looking for. Fine. What do you want in return? What do you think I want? Maybe the same thing both of us want? The city has electricity again. The renegades are on the attack. For the first time since the war ended, they attacked our outposts in the city center. But new possibilities have opened up for us as well. Thanks to the electricity, we can fire up the biggest antenna in the center, on the VNC Tower Spire. Wait, you want to defeat the Butcher using radio? In a way, the signal will let me reach a larger number of people. Communication between settlements will be improved. We'll enlist more recruits and defend the city. And then it will be easier to find the surviving GRE doctors you need. Okay, I'm in. Good. The Butcher attacked for a reason. I want to make sure this city is safe, no matter what. You all right, sir? Maya will share our plan with you. Go see her as soon as you can. Oh, and Aiden. You don't have to call me sir. To friends, I'm Jack. Okay. Jack. Until today, our chances to get spray guys were pretty good. But now, I'm not so sure. Stephen, I'm filthy hurt, bro. Will decide my husband's fate. Is that why you got a medical degree? To go running to quacks for magic cures? Listen, we don't have medicine. Herbs are our only chance. My husband has fought for you for years. You must get medicine for him, not some herbs that might poison him. 
Time to go, kids. How is he? Ator is strong, but he needs medicine. And that, unfortunately, we don't have. We did the best we could with what we have. After the chemical attack, some plants gained healing properties. They worked like an antibiotic. But still, I, people here have strong opinions about healers, but you can hardly blame them. The folk healers give sound advice, but it can prove difficult to follow correctly. Misremember something, gather the wrong herb or use the wrong dosage, and instead of medicine, you administer poison, which has happened plenty. I can help. You'd be doing us a big favor. What happened in old Velador is terrible. We've lost so many people. As far as I know, Ator is our only witness. So if he dies, we don't find out what happened there. Exactly. Right, where can I find this healer? On COVID Island. Don't worry. You can trust Margaret. See you. Yes, he wanted me to give you this. A little reward for helping us peacekeepers. A UV flashlight could come in handy. Thanks. He said something about a plan? The VNC tower. Now that the lights are on, we can use the TV antenna to broadcast our call for mobilization. But first, we need to get to the top. And that's a long road. What do you want to know? Tell me more about this radio station on the tower. It's the tallest building in Villador. It was once a symbol of the city's greatness. Now, a symbol of its fall. Why do you say that? That antenna could bring the city together once more. But anyone who goes up there trying to fire it up, guess what happens? Nothing good, I bet. Damn right. The city's potential shining beacon is a death trap. We're hoping it'll be different this time. We're going to light it up with UV lamps. Okay, let's get going. Are the lights in place? They would be, if Juan from Supplies would just do his job for once. I take it that he didn't. He's been playing hide-and-seek the last few days, and he's late. Getting on my nerves. So look in on Juan first. See what his deal is. And when you do find him, kick him in the ass. Tell him it's from me.
down by Raynor himself. He took the effort to... Looking for Juan Raynor. You don't appear to be on a schedule. It's urgent. The commander sent me. So Monsieur Jacques sends you? Jacques? Jacques Matt. Monsieur Reyna is not here. I can't take a message. No, I need to talk to him in person. Where is he? Unfortunately, I can't help. Monsieur Reyna's whereabouts are no one's business. Wait if he must. Anything else? Now wait, but you're no fun. What about your boss? What's he do for fun? Monsieur Reyna is well known as a connoisseur of the finer things in life. Food, drink, and pretty much anything that walks on two legs. Is he near any of these so-called finer things right now? Maybe I can drop in on him there. Nice try, but no. I won't say. Matt's not gonna be happy. Juan is not particularly concerned with the little major's feelings. Do come again. In the one? Aiden, getting settled in the city? Working on it. Meyer and Jack sent me to supply. Interesting bunch. Not like any of the other PKs I've met. That might be because they're not PKs, Eagle Eye. Business is their true faith. I see. Anyway, I can't track down their boss. Juan? He likes to make himself scarce. Probably lurking around the fish eye. The canteen? The slick bastard's even got his own table there. Bribes the cook to bring him off-menu goods. He lives like the fall never took place. I look for him there. Good luck finding him. And good luck if you do find him. of the war. I hear the PK engineers are working on alarms and electric traps. Yeah. <sighs> 
You ain't gonna... Rainer? You lost, man? We didn't call for a waiter. I've got orders to find you from Meyer and the commander. And my name's... I know who you are, Aiden. After that bang-up with the renegades, half the canteen wants to name their most precious offspring after you. Including Vinny here. But you interrupted our meal. State your purpose in one sentence, then please make yourself <laughs> scarce. Well, you know perfectly well why I'm here. The UV lamps. Meyer says you owe the peacekeepers a delivery. And you think your barking will make an impression on me? The Lummox and Chief Jack thinks he can scent his terrier, and everyone will wet themselves in terror. <clears throat> but what can I expect? He can't tell the difference between champagne and a crystal chalice, or water from a dog's bowl. He has an ounce of refinement. Isn't that right, Vinny? I don't know. Don't be afraid. It's not like Jack is gonna march in and have you hanged. At least not now. Uh... Ah, oh, Vinny. When will you grow a spine? You want my attention, Aiden? Show me you deserve it. What can you offer me? How about a court-martial? Matt can do that, right? <laughs> a court-martial? You have no idea who you're talking to, do you? Who would hash out the contracts with the suppliers? Who would feed the army, provide it with weapons and clothing? A week without me, and the peacekeepers will be left with nothing. Supply is everything. Try again, man. And don't improv this time. <sighs> I'm... Look, I could help you out as easily as I'm trying to help Matt. I don't doubt that. I've heard you were a pilgrim. But you're new here. Smashing the skulls of a few peasants doesn't mean everyone wants to lift you up on their backs. You have to be more subtle with people. Everyone has their own desire, their, their own price. Your pitch just isn't working for me quite yet. Try again. Mm -hmm. <sighs> You've used up all your time. Didn't pique my interest. Look, what is it you want, Juan? <sighs> like they used to say, if you gotta ask the price, you can't afford it. Returning to more pressing matters. And? Did you make headway with the pompous ass? I've never met a guy quite like him before. I told you. Come see me back at my place. We'll talk. Maybe some fruit. Sweets always do good. Just like you've gone down. I thought the same thing. Ray, Murph. Let me guess. He scarfed down five courses and had a hot young woman at his side. A young man, but the rest is accurate. He's a piece of work, all right. But I need him to get back to work. Jack needs UV lamps and Juan's dragging his feet. Hmm, that'll be tough. Juan barely listens to Jack, so he'll be an even tougher audience for you. He has his own men and power base and he loves rubbing Jack's nose in that. And what can I do about that? Same as everyone else, bribe him. He likes fine art, antiques, expensive shit from before the fall. When he sees something that used to be valuable, he can't stop himself. Zero self-control. Hmm. All right, where can I find something like that? I heard of an old Polish guy who lived in a penthouse by Liberation Passage. 
They say he was an art collector. You can try his place. You can only get there via paraglider. That's why there's a chance something is left. I'll be on the radio and guide you to him. What about you, huh? Going on a hunt? No, a party. It's Danier's birthday, but you never know when a guest list will overlap with a hit list. Why don't you come and have a drink with us when you're done with one? I don't think Danier likes me. <laughs> he doesn't like anybody. We'll be in touch. Go, find some art. Class B and Class C power have been suspended until further. 
further notice. Medical and sanitation personnel are now required to show identification at each security checkpoint. Not yet. I've reached the building, but... How did you say I should get to the top? Use a vent. There should be one on the roof. When you get there, stand on it, jump, and open your paraglider. Easy. That sounds sketchy. Name the last non-sketchy thing you've done running around this town. Touché. One, there's nothing left in here. Daniel said it's a virgin spot. Keep looking. He took his paintings, but no room for Jessica. <laughs> One romantic son of a bitch.
Ah, fuck. There aren't any paintings left. Everything's been destroyed. Hey, Luan? Found our collector, but no sign of his collection. Luan? Hey, you there? Jesus, Aiden. I told you I was leaving. Yeah. Okay, quick thing. Nothing here except for a bottle of whiskey and one of vodka. At least the whiskey's the good stuff. Juan likes a good whiskey. Maybe if you get him shit-faced, he'll loosen up, so to speak. So you still in the canteen? I saw him leaving. Seemed to be heading back to the ship. Probably to his quarters. Okay, I'll go there. And listen, that vodka? Danier is a big fan. If you're planning to drop by, which you probably aren't. But if you really want to get to know this city, this is the way. Just saying. Interesting question. I've heard stories. Happy birthday, Daniel. Oh, so you have come after all. Yeah, here. A little something to celebrate another year on the planet. What do you want from me, Gacho? What do you mean? What do you need? Why the gift all of a sudden? But the one said it's your birthday, so I thought you... I understand the concept of a birthday gift. To get it said in a war. Yeah, uh... Okay, uh, listen. Happy birthday. <sighs> Lost the bet. But at least I have something to cheer me up. Well, back? Never mind. Lavon is at the bar.
You invited me. Didn't you want me here? Let me get a bottle so you can catch up with us. Hey, Ro? Off duty, hmm? Listen, you know how stressful things can be sometimes. You get your orders, they don't make any sense. You're fighting the clock to get shit done. Oh, I feel you. Trust me. So, you made it. Luan won. What? Is this about some bet? Yeah, with Daniel. She was sure you'd come. Him, not so much. It's almost as if it mattered to her. That's unusual. Here, Aiden. Drink. Nicholas's finest booze. We were about to play a game. No, Luan, we weren't. Come on. I'm out. Yeah, count me out. Too drunk already. A bunch of losers. Aiden, are you playing? Okay, let's do it. My man! Rules are simple. You either answer an awfully personal question about yourself, or you must perform the dare. Okay, wait, so if I don't want to answer the question, I get to pick the dare. You wish. We decide whether it's a truth or dare. If you don't do as you're told, you drink. So, have you slept with anyone in Villador? And I'll drink. What? What are you hiding, Aiden? Don't think you're taking the easy way out. The drunker you get, the less you care about keeping your secrets. Oh, shut up, Ro. You, Aiden. Drink, my friend. Okay. Your turn. I want to hear you play. Fuck off. Wait, what do you mean play? I'll drink. Forget about it. You play an instrument. Never mind. I drank. Moving on. She used to play the ukulele. Really? Guys, moving on. Aiden, you play for Ro, and I dare you to ask Ro to sing. It's awful. There. Let's hear those pipes, Ro. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> you asked for it. You're my ragamuffin. You might think I'm tough and all, but I always have a ball with you. Woo, 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 woo. You're my ragamuffin. I know it's just a silly name, but you set my heart aflame. It's true. Good lord, shoot me. Shoot me dead before I have to hear another note. Wow, man, that was... That was something. Okay, enough of this. Anything you want to ask the master assassin here? I always wondered about that hit list. Shut up, bro. It's not your turn. Oh, yeah, the, the hit list. How did it start? With a bastard who had to pay for what he did. It started with one. Then there was another one. And then a whole bunch of them. But who was the first one? That's another question. Drink. No, he's just making you answer the first one. Who cares what he asked? It started way before that. When I escaped from Waltz. Frank helped me. He showed me that there's something else I can do with all my anger. Back then, I thought I'd join them. Be a night runner someday. Ugh. Who was I kidding? They were wiped out at the VNC Tower. Frank lost almost everyone. Night runners fell. Frank started to drink. 
gave up on life. On himself. <laughs> so... I'm not a night runner. But at least I have my list. <sighs> Good night. Did I ask the wrong question? That's the beauty of this game, Pilgrim. Sooner or later, you get to the wrong question. I'll see you soon, I guess. Gajo! Here you are! Thank you. Thank you for the vodka. Thank you. Let's drink! For me? And another year in this... shithole. You're not the worst, you know. Are you finally warming up to me? Nah, it just means there are worse assholes. And that I'm drunk. Where's Levan? I saw her with you. Now we played the game, and I asked the wrong question. How the hit list started? <sighs> gotcha, gotcha. You got her thinking about the past. Listen, and I'm not telling you this because I like you. I don't even fucking know why I am telling you this. But never, never ask Levan about her past. You get it? Good. Now, get lost. It's my birthday. like that. Where's that son of a bitch hiding? I could go for a drink right now. against Renegades were pretty good. But 
now. I'm not so sure. Goddamn renegades attacking the canteen now? Isn't he, dear? Care to join? More the merrier. No, thank you. Ah, oh, have I embarrassed you? I'm sorry, I do have that effect on people. I'll wait for you, but make it quick. I must admit, I admire your persistence. Almost curious what you do after I send you packing, yet again. You'll regret it. Sixteen-year-old Highland single malt. Modeled a year before the pandemic broke out. This stuff sold at auction for over half a million dollars. <sighs> what a sublime present. broke down my defenses. So, you're still after those lamps. Did Matt tell you why he wanted them? Why he really wanted them? Yeah, to take control of the TV tower. Wait, he's serious? Is he crazy? Nobody tried that for over a decade. Matt wants to prepare to defend the city from the Butcher's coming attack. So, we should start building him a monument, right? Only problem? The Butcher isn't planning any attack. How do you know? I have my spies. Among the renegades as well. Since the end of the war, we have occupied the city center. While the Colonel squats in the dam. One push of a lever. And half the city will find itself under toxic water. The Colonel is not stupid. He knows war would be the end of everything. What about the UV lamps? Why does he want them, then? Jack is hiding something. For a while now, he's been ordering way more lamps than he could possibly need. And then some of those lamps always disappear. No accounting for them once we deliver. I'm not here for my health, Juan. I need the lamps to- To find out what happened to your sister. Right, Aiden? I told you I got my spies. Might be able to find something out about Waltz and your sister. Specifically about the GRE scientist you and Matt are trying to contact. I'd even say with my resources, I can find this person faster than Matt. I actually doubt he's able to find them at all. I know you're not using me to make a movie your own. I'm not your enemy, Aiden. It's a shame you don't see that. You'll get your lamps. 
You just gotta talk to Demolan. Who's he? He's my man. Sent him out to search for more lamps, but he hasn't checked in for a while. Where can I find him? Around here. Last I heard from him. Find him. Then come back to me here afterward. You got it. Talk more about whiskey?